Start from the beginning of the stage. What is this crap? Chapter 3, Maze Woods. THROUGH THE THORNY MAZE! Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Let's Play Legend... Whoa. Let's... Let's play Wario Land 2 with Mio X Fu, and... Oh, just as it has been good to get back to Legend of Zelda, it is so good to get back to this, because I am so... over having an actual... Ah! Having an actual real game to play. Oh my goodness, it has been so long since I've played this, and it's so great! Because... Honestly, those two games made up so much of my childhood because I would just play them for hours and hours and hours on end, and I have no idea what we actually have to do in here. But we meet a new enemy, these zapper guys, and they're crazy because they'll zap you with electricity that they shoot from their heads. But who cares, they're pushovers. Honestly, I do not remember this, this at all. Oh wait. Oh wait. Shoot. I remember this one. This is another owl level, isn't it? And I may or may not hate this one with a burning passion. But we'll get to that later. <laughs> Seems like I'm saying that a lot lately. We'll get to that later. We'll get to that later. We'll get to that later. Oh, goodness. You know, so I've got a funny story to tell you guys tonight. Because I'm, I'm recording this. At night. But anyway, now that I'm stealing Harry's and... Harry's <laughs> thing, um, but not really. Uh, no, the thing I had, ooh, forgot they made noises when they came back. I forget so much about this because, again, I haven't played it in like two weeks. Oh my god, and just seeing Wario and his greedy face and, ha 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 ha, do I missed? Do I got money? Oh, it's just so great to have Wario back. I mean, Hedonia's been ba bashing him so much in his Mario Party 5 Let's Play, and I'm like, but, but, Wario's cool, and I mean, he was your first Let's Play, he was, he was part of your first Let's Play, don't, don't bring him down, man. But no, actually getting to the funny story that I have to tell you guys. Now, as I've said before, I'm sure, I am not much of the crowd that partakes of coffee that often. And when I do, it's usually because I have an all-nighter or something similar to that that I have to take care of. Ah! I hate you, squid guys. You can die. Yeah, that works. Um... But anyway, like I was saying, usually when I partake of the caffeinated warm beverage, and it is not tea when it is coffee, usually the reasons are that I am experiencing a, a mighty need! To use the restroom. No, um, I'm experience a, experiencing a mighty need to use caffeine because I have an all-nighter that I'm going to pull, whether it be for a school assignment or for some other reason. And okay, just making sure we're not dropping any frames. Whoa, why aren't you rolling? Okay, there we go. Part of the problem with this is I think I may be allergic to coffee, so I usually get sick every every night that I drink it. But it's a necessary... Why... Okay. That just was weird. My controller stopped working for a second. It's probably... It's probably low on batteries. Yep, it is. Okay, um... I'll be right back. Alrighty, that should do. What I did was just... I didn't even... I, I said I was gonna be right back, but I didn't even go anywhere. I just leaned over, took my mouse out of my backpack, and took the battery from that. Easy as cake. Um, but what was I saying? Yes, because of my rather inconsistent of adventures with coffee-related caffeine, I have... I consume a vast amount of soda instead in order to get my caffeine addiction fix. So... What that means is that I go to a lot of convenience stores. However, I don't go to just a lot of convenience stores. I especially go to one that I used to work a few um, over the summer a few years back, just because I know people there, and it's nice. To it's it's just nice to talk to them sometimes. I mean, s still a couple, pe quite a few people working there. Um, I mean, my family's very good friends with the 
owner. She was almost actually a part of our family, but didn't work. Um, come on. I know I can get you up there very easily. There we go. See, now was that, was that, was that so hard? No, the answer is no, it wasn't. Doesn't matter though, because we got normal to go. Uh, I'll tell the rest of the story after this. You, 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 ooh. I see you, Harry Cullen. There you are. Anyway, um, oh, let's see what treasure we got first. And we got the golden apple. Huzzah! I have no idea. I, I wish I actually knew Wario Three, because I could be like, oh, in Wario Land Three, it does so and so. Fuck you, owl. I mean, sorry. I I love you, owl, because you are actually going to bring us through this thorny maze. But I'm an idiot, and I'm going to try to get every single coin in this thorny maze, too. Even though we're probably uh, good with what we have. Ah, but I am greedy because I am Wario. Um, yeah, nice thing about it is you, he can hit the spikes. You can't, though. Um, uh, okay, um, anyway. The rest of the story. So, I went in... Once again, to that same self same convenience store to buy a Mountain Dew because I just didn't feel like Pepsi. I didn't feel like Pepsi tonight. Usually, though, I am the Pepsi fiend. <sighs> well, we missed all the coins. Big deal. For some reason, I thought it was not the Le was not the middle, but I guess I was wrong. It just seemed too obvious, you know. Um. Ah. Come on, I want those coins. Anyway, with my caffeine fix that I needed to get, I ended up visiting that self-same convenience store, and I ended up talking to one of my old co-workers, um, a guy that goes by the name of Brian. Maybe. Maybe he goes by the name of Tom. Maybe he goes by the name of Dan. You'll never know. But then again, you'll never know who he is anyway, so it doesn't really matter. <laughs> Um, the point I'm trying to drive at is that he asked me, Oh, so how are you doing? And I'm... Uh, at first it was just like, yeah, I'm doing okay, you know. Normal stuff. Uh, later on, though, I went back and I'm like, you know what? I'm doing really good, because the most amazing thing is happening to me this weekend. I am going to see They Might Be Giants live in concert at... in Boston. And lo and behold, would you believe that... Where I'm going to see them in Boston is actually the college that my girlfriend used to go to. And I think that's just pretty hilarious <laughs> that I am going there. And she's in she's not even here. She's in Kentucky right now at HobbitCon. <laughs> um But no, it was funny because we got into talking about just different people from bands and fame and whatnot. And he's like, oh, did you see the bus when you were coming in? And I'm like, no, no, I, I didn't see it. He's like, oh, uh, Ted Tintern or something, um, he was just in here, he's a big country star. And I'm like, okay, I'll take your word for it, I have no idea, any idea about country. And it was just, hey, we just got into this tirade of, about line dancing and about how, like, the people that are really into it, they have actual, like, cases for their boots, like, they'll have those um, fiber cases that are pretty much indestructible that people put, like, instruments and violins in. It was just one of the most ridiculous things I've ever heard, but, yeah, let's end the level. It was just, you know, funny story I wanted to pass along. So anyway, we got the golden apple. Yeah! Eyebrow twitch. And wink. Way to go. Yeah, of course we're gonna play it. Give us another. Arr, give us another. Right, I'm guessing eight, but I could be wrong. It could be a six. I'm thinking this is a six or a five. I still don't have enough information. I still don't have enough information. Damn it, game. <laughs> That's a five. 
Because again, I don't want to go back for any of these tiles unless we miss the treasure, which there's that one level that I have to go back to now. Plus, I, I like seeing the map actually fill in. I've never actually gotten all of these map pieces at once. I'll see you guys next episode on Let's Play Wario Land 2 with me, Alex Fu. Take it easy.